Hey guys, James Ryan here and welcome to my new YouTube channel that's going to be dedicated just to guitar lessons. So I'm going to also talk a little bit about the guitars amps effects I'm using um, as well just so you know how I'm getting the tones but for the most part we're just going to get down to some playing. So here's the lick that I uh, did before, I'm going to slow it down a little bit and show you how to play it. It sounds like this. Okay, so we're going to get in nice and close now so I can show you what this is all about. I'm based around the ninth fret here and it's an F sharp minor, uh, minor 7 arpeggio. Starts with a little scale lick that goes like this. So first notes at the 12th fret, 12 to 9, and then 10 on the first string. 12th fret on the second, back to the 9th on the first string. So. Then after that it's just a sweep all the way down, starting on the 10th fret of the 2nd string, it's just a descending on an F sharp minor, so 10th fret 3rd string, oh sorry 2nd string, on the 11th fret of the 3rd, 11th fret of the 4th string, 12th fret of the 5th, and ending on the 9th, so a sweep that goes, so the first part is So in actual fact what you've got is a descending sweep going from the ninth, um, ninth fret of the first string all the way down. So I'm also doing a doing a, a uh, pull off and a hammer on at the start. show you a little variation on that arpeggio. Um, you only have to change a couple of notes and it changes from being an F sharp minor to an A major sound based on the good old that shape there that uh, quite a few of you will be familiar with. So we start with exactly the same and all that happens is once we get to that ninth fret on the first string you descend in the, the uh, A major shape which is So 9th fret on the 1st, 10th on the 2nd string, 9th fret on the 3rd, 11th fret on the 4th string and then end on the 12th fret of the A string. So so you can either have a minor sound or a major. Thanks very much for tuning in for the very first lesson on my new YouTube channel. Um, if you've got any requests or ideas for lessons, please let me know about them. And uh, I've certainly got plenty of ideas of things I'd like to show you. And I plan to get a lot of lessons up very quickly, so hope to see you soon. Cheers.